Is autumn one of your favorite seasons? It is indeed a glorious season when leaves turn orange and red, the sky changes color, the forest becomes a true painting with a thousand shades of gold. But it means that winter is coming, the days are getting shorter, you feel the lack of natural light on your body, and your morale takes a dip. Time to avoid depression and recharge your batteries in the sun. Prepare your holidays in beautiful destinations where, even in winter, the sun is at the rendezvous. Go on, treat yourself to a sunny break in the warmest and sunniest destinations for winter sun in Europe. Number 10 The Greek Islands, Greece, the gorgeous Aegean is surely the loveliest of Europe's seas and the water off many of the Cyclades, such as Paros, Santorini and Milos, is still tolerable in winter, making it a year-round destination for swimmers. In places like Santorini, visiting in the off-season means you can explore the picturesque vistas without the crowds, while Rhodes is known to have clear blue skies and warm temperatures well into winter. Number 9 Malaga, Spain, Malaga is a great city surrounded by other jewels of European tourism such as the Caminito del Rey, this incredible walk along the mountains of Spain and exceptional small cities like Ronda and its famous bridge ranked among the most beautiful bridges of Europe. During the coldest months, you will enjoy at least 5 hours of sunshine a day in Malaga and average temperatures of 17 degrees, 63 Fahrenheit, in the daytime. Number 8 The Azores, Portugal, you might think that including the Azores is stretching the definition of Europe to breaking point, but the Atlantic Archipelago is actually about 5 hours from London. And, in any case, they're not your typical isolated island group. For starters, it's never that hot here, even in summer. People don't visit to Lays on the beach Maldives style. They come because it's a natural nirvana, rich in wildlife, full of rugged, dramatic craters and caverns, hot springs and lush forests all of which are being sustainably managed, only 5% of the land is developed and the islands are dotted with marine conservation parks. Number 7 Antalya, Turkey, straddling two continents, Turkey's enormous landmass is diverse enough to justify its nickname, the land of four seasons. For winter sun, the best part of the country to visit is, predictably, the south coast, particularly the area around Antalya. There's a long stretch of fairly upmarket hotels to the west of the city, many of which are family-friendly entertainment retreats in their own right, with golf courses and adventure playgrounds beside the beach. On Turkey's wilder southwest coast, there's the pretty city of Bodrum and lovely Didim with its astonishing ruined temple. Number 6 Cyprus, the name Limassol, the capital of Cyprus, immediately evokes holidays in the sun. Come and discover one of the most beautiful islands in Europe and one of the best destinations in Europe to enjoy the sun all year long, you can explore the history of the island or its most beautiful monuments or rest on its hot sand, see idyllic landscapes, go diving or just sunbathe on the Pasuri, Santa Barbara or the Vraisudia beaches, they all fly the blue flag. Number 5 Nijas, Spain, this beautiful and charming little town in Spain is totally different from other European destinations. Its sunny climate throughout the year makes it one of the best destinations for a sunny holiday in Europe in winter. The warm air of the sea will warm you up and recharge your batteries. It is very rare to see snow in Nijas in winter, in fact it happens every 10 years and the last time was in 2012. Number 4 Canary Islands, Spain, in summer, the breeze that hits Lanzarote and Fuerteventura is blessed relief from the intense heat and a major draw for windsurfers. In winter, said breeze brings with it a bit of a chill, so you're better off heading to the other Canary Islands, Tenerife or Gran Canaria. The former has made great strides repositioning itself as a cultural hub with an art gallery designed by Swiss firm Herzog and de Moron and Santiago Calatrava's Concert Hall in Santa Cruz, and the latter has plenty of charm beyond the overdeveloped tourist spots. The capital, Las Palmas, has a lively food scene and the landscape, particularly around Village Art Nara, is mana for hikers. Flights to both islands from London are under four and a half hours. Number 3 The Algarve, Portugal, continental Europe's most southwestern region has its own sunny microclimate that makes it consistently warmer than the rest of Portugal. You won't be in a bikini in winter, but the pleasant t-shirt temperatures mean that an increasing number of hotels and restaurants stay open year-round, and cities such as Albufeira retain a buzz. Away from the packaged tourist haunts, there are dramatic red cliff coastlines and Moorish villages dotted among the hills to explore. Number 2 Malta, its frankly ridiculous 300 days of sunshine a year would be the standout selling point for most islands of Malta's size, but the understated Mediterranean gem is also a history-soaked gastronomic hub, packed with first-class hotels and surrounded by some of the world's best diving sites. Visit in winter for a weekend exploring striking Valletta, the ancient capital that's had a bit of a revival of late, converting some of its gorgeous townhouses into excellent design hotels. The restaurant scene is thriving, too. Head to Panorama at the British Hotel in Valletta or Barracuda near the Slima coast for a taste of traditional Mediterranean food.
Number 1 Madeira, Portugal, the longtime destination of choice for Britain's Blue Rinse Brigade, stayed old Madeira has been busy reinventing itself as a place for adrenaline-fueled adventure. And why not? The island is an outdoor Eden in miniature, with black sand beaches, tumbling canyons and epic rock faces, which means great mountain biking and wonderful views for those who dare to go paragliding. The network of levadas makes for thrilling trail running. It is also, as far as we know, the only place to offer year-round urban tobogganing and wicker sleds, which are steered downhill at great speed. I hope this post has given you lots of inspiration for where to travel to for some warm sunshine this winter. There's nothing like a few days of sunshine and adventures to give you a little boost of energy to get you through the colder months. Thank you for you watching, subscribe for more content.